Yo, what's up, everybody? What's up? It's your boy Blitz, and it's your boy Bliggity Iggity Iggity Blur. Yo, yo, we got some more GCE news for y'all, which is Game Changers news. That's right. So we come to give y'all the latest and most updates on all the gaming stuff that you might want to jump on. So, yo, ready to jump off into it, Blur? I am ready when you are ready, because I'm ready when you're ready to give me what we need to do right now. Well, all right. So, yo, what y'all witnessing now is uh, because of scheduling issues and things of that nature, we're unable to be in the same. Oh, 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 we oh, can't. Yes. We can't occupy the same breathing space hold, right now. Hold on, but, hold yo, on. tell them why. Tell them why. Yeah, tell we got a new. Why. We got a new furry addition to the family, and uh, which is my uh, my brand new puppy, and so she needs some TLC. So I couldn't tear away just yet. So, but it's all it's all good. Oh, know? maybe we could do a a, a TikTok video. Of you and your furry new friend, my furry new baby. Yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe we can introduce it to TikTok. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, we're gonna jump right into that GCE news for y'all. So first up the bat, we got some news that just dropped, just which dropped. is which is Star Wars Republic Commando. Mm-hmm. Now, um, now, now, I don't know. I mean, you guys out there, Star Wars fans, but I'm more, I'm kind of guy that appreciates a good Star Wars game every once in a while. How about you, Blur? Me too. Me too. Is um is, is I think it's a remaster if I'm not mistaken. And, yeah. Um, it looks good. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna let you see it, and then what we'll do? We'll come back and give you our thoughts on it. All right. Yes, sir. Ooh. May the force be with you. May the fourth be with you. What? <laughs> Let's go. Push those cannons to the start. Join the three brothers and become fierce hunters for the Republic. Stay quiet. Move in. Execute assault. Affirmative, sir. Hit him hard, Delta. Yo, there it is. I mean, Yo. for for an older game, bro, it looks it, the remaster edition does look pretty decent. Um, yeah. it's not going to be like a remake. A remake would be something that's going to be remade from the ground. Yeah, up. Yeah, well, they completely redo the graphics and everything. Yes. This is just this is just remastered. So yeah, so they didn't do it that way. Um, but the the thing about it is, it is done by Lucas Arts because right. it's a it, you know it's originally done in two thousand and five, mm-hmm. which is under Lucas Arts. And uh, it was only on PC and Xbox originally because it was right. like a straight PC port. So a lot of right. the next gen consoles didn't get it. Right. Uh, Xbox, because they're so, it was very PC orientated. It was probably easy transition to right. switch it over to get them to do it. But uh, the new one's coming out. This new remastered version is coming out for the Nintendo Switch Woo! and the PS4. Woo! So that'll give the next generation people a chance to get their hands on it. Uh, that's going to be April the 6th. Now, understand it is a first-person shooter, squad-based, so you do control your squad. Um, so you could be tactical. So it's not just yeah. you running around by yourself. You have your squad with you. It looks like it's going to be pretty fun. Now, I'm not really into first-person shooters like that, um, but it looks like it'd be something I can get into um, yeah. or would get into. So we'll see. We'll see how, how, how people, how people um, take it in to see if they really yeah. like it or not. I mean, it's still better than... Um, I think it's still good enough to get a lot of people hands on it. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I'm, like, like I said, I'm the kind of guy that every once in a while, a good Star Wars game, just, just, you just want to get your hands on. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You just, that, dun, dun, da, 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 you know, it just, it just feels good to get your hands on some Star Wars. Cause I mean, if Lucas Arts was ahead of his time, imagine if they would have came out mm-hmm. now with that Star Wars type stuff and the next I generation mean, game and consoles and stuff. I'd have rather seen a redo of that game. To see what see and remake it all together, make it yeah, just to see if they can just remake it from the ground up and see how well, it, how it looks. I, I think I think this is their attempt because they got so many um many uh working franchises now for it. Mm-hmm. 
um, with Battlefront and different things of that nature that really took hold of that first person shooter style. Right. So uh, they probably feel like they didn't have the need to do it. So yeah. uh, hopefully we'll see some like 1313 or that new that new game stuff that's coming out since uh, EA Sports lost the exclusivity for the Star Wars franchise. So we probably got a bunch of hot games coming up. This is probably just something they've thrown in the water. So everybody like, mm, you know. <laughs> Tip their toe in the water. Here you go. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Trying, to get a, trying to get a lips wet. All right, so move right on to the next game. This one is called Pascal's Wager, the Definitive Collection. This one also is a, a port from an older game that was done on PC, right. but uh, looks like it's going to be a remake of it. But uh, according to the trailer, it looks, looks kind of interesting. All right, so here go the trailer, and we'll give you our thoughts after the trailer. Yo. So, Budira God bless me this time. I'm sorry, Terence, but nobody can leave the Dark Mist alive. He was my only choice. You should never trust someone too easily. So what do you think, man? Well, it, think? it has a, when it first when it first came on, it had a uh, I felt like I was looking at a uh, Jura from The Witcher a little bit, and he had some um, Dark Souls armor on, you know, yeah. <laughs> it was like a uh, like a uh, like a Dark Souls kind of. Uh, but the character, the first character I saw with the white hair, meant my mind went straight to Gerard from um, The Witcher. I think it, it to me it looks like Bloodborne or Blood is it Bloodborne? Bloodborne, yeah. yeah. It looks like a Bloodborne, which was done Souls. by the Dark Souls people, yeah. Which yeah, is so a similar game. So it still looks like a Bloodborne type of game. Yeah, with yeah, yourself yeah. with a couple of characters interacting with you, and you're you're just killing monsters. So, I, I mean, it looks yeah. good. It it's, looks, it's, 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 it's your average day. You know, yeah, it's, it's, it's average. It's, it's, it's your dark cryptid kind <laughs> of beat everybody. Even the the guy looked like he had a dag on. Um, a coffin as a as a weapon so i'm like dang i'm like Woof. yeah i uh once again we have it um we didn't play the original uh oh. this one i believe was on pc only but right. it looks pretty good so kicking you guys some facts it's made by a company called tips works tips works so and they do some tips in the jar for them? tips works yeah yeah tips works which is yeah Tips works. <laughs> Tips work. I would kind of say. All right. Uh, so the platforms are going to be for the PS4, Microsoft right. Windows, Xbox One. Mm -hmm. And you're looking at a release date of March 12th. That's not so bad. it's going to come up. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's a remake. It's probably to support a hard port over mm -hmm. to the uh, the new systems and things of that nature. Um, it still looks a little old school. It looks um, good, though. It still looks clean. Yeah, it, yeah, it doesn't look bad at all. It, but you still got that old school feel to it, which is not necessarily a bad thing. We right. we appreciate the old school, you right. know, for what it's worth, because they made these, they made it possible for the games we play now. That's right. So, so that's just something, some interesting out there to hit the game news, John. Hit the hit the stratosphere for the game news. We want to throw out you guys, yeah. uh, in case it's on someone's radar. Right. All right. So the next game we got coming up. Uh, now this one. <laughs> this one, I, I'm kind of getting excited for. Uh, it's a uh, <laughs> well. It's, it's Diablo Four. So, yeah, yeah. So if you're a Diablo fan and you've been um, showing on the franchise for a minute, you'll get to see how they've been uh, gradually building it up to get better and better with the going. Um, so the original, the original uh, Diablos came out a, a while ago. Uh, it's ported on PC, made it to a couple of game consoles. So Diablo it looks real 3, good. Diablo Three is the one that you could play right now. 
Yeah. Um, and I've got Diablo three plus I think the la- the last um DLC they had um I think which was the Necromancer, um if yeah. I'm not mistaken. So I the sorcerer that. sorcerer Necromancer yeah. Yes, yeah, so I played that um beat the game with that, but it, I mean to me just it was just being a Diablo three fan. Yeah, um, yo, you guys good. check out the check out the trailer and tell us what you think. But it, it looks real good to me. Actually, this trailer is showing off the new class that they just announced, yes. and that's the rogue class. Rogue. So here you go. Enjoy, please. Diablo Four. Pray with me. May Akarat guide and protect me. May Akarat guide and protect me. May he shepherd my soul. May he shepherd my soul. And grant it mercy. And grant it mercy. What are you doing here? This is not the time. But this is confession. And I have sinned. I was a thief who stole from those more fortunate. I strayed from your light and found my trade in the shadows. They call it murder. I say, job well done. Save me. Hmm. You mark our light. But those monsters were a scourge upon my flock. And you... Oh, you were the answer to their prayers. Then we are settled. And you owe me. The name you see is thank the heavens for you heavens I assure you father the heavens didn't send me All right, so yo, yo, that don't look hot, don't it? <laughs> yeah, I like the part where she was putting the ears down. She was like, hey, what was that? That was payment. That was payment. She they paid the, ears. She gave the um the priest the ears, and if you watched all the way to the end of the um the video, the trailer, he puts the ears. She in the op- closet opens or up the closet, 
and put the ears on. Basically, all the people he needed killed. Those are the ears of the people that he needed killed. I'm like, what? Wow. I mean, I can't, I can't I, trust, I can't trust the priest, man. That's, you, that's, you, kind, of, that's kind of hardcore. Yo. Hold on, you ain't pay your tithes, they will be collecting your ear. I'm like, ah! I know. I hope they don't do that now. I hope, but I hope it, it looks good. I mean, the way she was moving, the way she was cutting through people, the speed, the agile, Dude, her, the sword. and then and then she put out the bow and did yeah. the multiple bow shot. It looks like a top view of a uh, open world style game. I know it's not open world, but no, Diablo it kind of feels like you're looking at Assassin's Creed, uh, Valhalla, or something like that from a from a heightened distance with that fast pace. Yeah. It has a fast pace running gun about it, but it is very well done. Um, Diablo, I like it. Diablo has always been like a, a, a generator. Like if you go on a board, every board is not the same. Me and you could be on two different um the same mission, but the board layout would be different because I think it's I think it's um is um done like that. So when you go on the board, the board is never the same. The never the same. So never, never the it same. sounds like um myself and some of y'all out there need to get your hands on Diablo three and start yeah. chewing on that because unfortunately uh Blizzard's not gonna put out Diablo four to probably the next two years. Um which is fair. Diablo 3 franchise is doing pretty good. Maybe, um, you may be even 2024. 20, yeah, it, it hurts because they they put some press footage out about the rogue character now, but we may not see her for another couple of years. They, 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 they don't want it to be like this. <laughs> oh, Cyberpunk. <laughs> What's up, Mouse? Yeah. Like, I mean, are they, are they going to actually change the whole game? No, I, mean, I, think, one... I think they just want to make sure because Diablo... When you put a Di another Diablo out, it's like a big thing because people move from. I mean, people keep their old accounts, but that's like moving to a new, a whole new game because Diablo three and Diablo four is not gonna, you know, it's gonna, it's a whole. Oh, new game. so it's not like it's not like a World of Warcraft where you can mm -hmm. just no add add like no. A, it's not it's not gonna be a DLC type situation. No, a whole new is, game. This, this is a whole new game, whole new um Lilith Lilith. If I'm not Lilith. mistaken, is the, um, yeah, the bad guy of this one. <laughs> um, so. So how many have you played? How many you played total? I played only. I didn't get into the Diablo one or two. I played Diablo three. What made you pick up three? Um, uh, because me and a couple of my friends were playing at the same time. We beat the game together because you you can play together. Oh oh, online together co-op. Yeah, you can play co-op. Oh oh together. okay. It looks like you won't have to from some of the gameplay I've seen. Four, I mean, you can do you, you can be spelled. You can do it by yourself or you can do it with the group. It's made well, to play both ways. I'll, I'll get on this single player and put it on hard. You want to no? Maybe not. You don't want to do <laughs> Maybe that. not. You don't want to do that. All right. So, yo, those are games we got for you guys. But right. we, got a, uh, we got another update and an added treat for you, which is movie on the movie side of it. Yeah. So, man. what game are we talking about, Blur? We're talking about that Mortal Kombat. Dun, 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 dun. So... That game, I mean, uh, well, matter of fact, movie. it's not a game. It's a movie. Yeah. You know, it, my it, it, it was a game. Yeah, it's this a movie. Is one of the rest, yeah, one of the rest situations where it's a game and then it becomes a movie and create a whole new franchise. Not too many games has an entire franchise. Like that. So what we're going to do, we're going to let you see the latest trailer. Yes. And I'm going to let you know we might have to take, um, put it down to no sound. If the music music is copywritten, because sometimes we yeah. put stuff up, the music the music is copywritten and, and they'll flag it. Yeah, so, so we may have to kill the sound or something. So we might like have that. to kill the sound. So if you don't hear the sound, that's the reason why. But we're gonna roll the yep. clip for you right now. Pew, 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 pew. Fart. Get over <laughs> here. <laughs> Fatality. <laughs> Friendality. <laughs> oh, Animality. Peace. Beastality. Beastality? Beastality? I don't yeah. know. Uh, trailer. Trailer. I don't know. Here go the trailer. First learned about this seven years ago on a mission in Brazil to capture a wanted fugitive. When we got there, it tore through our unit in seconds. The target had superhuman abilities. It had the same marking you do, Cole. It's a birthmark. What do you mean? He was born with it. It's not a birthmark, Cole. It means you've been chosen. Throughout history, different cultures all over the world reference a great tournament of champions. 
That dragon marking? I think it's an invitation to fight for something known. As Mortal Kombat. These are your champions. I'm Sonya. That's Kano. I'm Liu Kang. Thanks, Jax. Kong La. Lord Raiden. The fate of Earth is in our hands. No matter how many of my people you put in the ground, we will not fail. Kill them. Fucking beauty. All right, so yo blur. Yo blur. Who's this cold kid, man? Who's cold? Uh, that, that's that that's that dude. Who's this kid, man? That's 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 that uh that's that sub zero. You can't oh, mess with sub zero. I've never seen I've never seen sub zero use his powers like that. When he actually yeah, when he took the blood like, arm. No, when he froze oh, Jack. um, Jack's arms and snapped his arms off, I'm like, I'm like, whoa, I'm like, ooh, I know, that's I know. nasty. And and the fact that Jax is still alive, so either he chose not to kill Jax, or somebody interrupted him from killing Jax, right, or and something so, to that nature. And so, so Jax, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, and then Jack's arms look good. I mean, I like the way they did his arms. Um, yeah. The I mean, it, I mean, until we get to really see it, see it. I hope it's not. I mean, for what I'm seeing, the CGI they could change. Good. It. They could change. They, the they CGI, could change yeah. it. But even oh, the guy who's playing um um Scorpion, that dude yeah. is hot. Yeah, it, actually, the guy playing Scorpion, uh, the guy playing Kong Lao, the guy playing Shang Tsung. I mean, all these guys are like, uh, if you're in the martial arts movies and you watch any, he was in, you the know, guy that played um Scorpion was in Ronan with Keanu Reeves, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Yeah, uh, uh, one of the other guys was too. So these the the, the guys they have on fresh off the boat. Now oh, the guy God. that's playing Cole, he's a newer actor, but he's not like it's not like his first movie or nothing like that. Right. So I want to know who his character is, the guy playing Cole, because I don't. He's either related to Sub Zero, he's related to Scorpion. I'm not sure how he falls. Into well, the I mean, other. I mean, I mean that might be Cole, but it looked like Sub Zero to me. I mean, if you're using Frozen powers, to me it looked like Sub Zero. Well, no, 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 that wasn't him fighting. Uh, Cole is a guy. Uh, if in the trailer, I seen the slow down version, the breakdown of the trailer. Um, when Sub Zero and Scorpion was fighting, Cole was laying was down on the floor. Oh, somebody put somebody put him on his butt, and then oh. the other two were fighting. Uh, like when he uh, there's one footage that was shows where uh, Sub Zero freezes the blood into a dagger and yeah. then uses it and use it as a dagger, which is. Ooh, no, I like the part the game. I, I, I think he was the game. Hold on, was he fighting um, Scorpion? Where he took his arm, froze it, then made a um, sheet of ice behind him, and then threw yeah. him through the sheet of ice. I think that that was that was when, like, right before that, when he cut him, uh, his blood pulled in air. He grabbed his blood and created the dagger, mm -hmm. and then hit him, and then stabbed him, and then it's created the sheet of ice, and then threw him into it. Because I think I'm that's all one scene. It could be multiple. Could be the way it was cut too. Because I'm not mistaken, um, Scorpion is immortal right now. He's not. He can't. He can't be killed. But see, neither one of them was attacking. Well, somebody put Cole on his back, so either one of them attacked him, and another one tried to stop him. Because remember, there's two Sub Zeros. There's right. an evil Sub Zero, which is original, and then there's Sub Zero twin brother, which was a good Sub Zero. Remember in the game, he had to cut over his eye, right? I and everybody was like, "Oh, Sub Zero, oh crap!" And then right. come to find out, he's he's his twin brother, which was good. So maybe that's who Cole is. Hopefully, or maybe maybe he's neither. I don't know. I'm just hoping it's better than Mortal Kombat two, three. <laughs> What are you talking about? Because Mortal, Mortal Kombat, Kombat 1 was the best. Mortal Kombat 2 sucked. Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 2 sucked? Annihilation sucked. 
Come on, man. It, 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 when they when they turned into the dragons, the oh, that, oh god, the CG the, the so CGI cool. dragons that I I could have made probably with out of play doh, um, out of play doh, paint creator. But but look, it was very it was very ambitious and innovative for that time. Um, I don't know what happened to the special effects budget. One um, was innovative. Christopher Christopher Lambert, Christopher Lambert, and um, the guy that played uh, Luke Kane. Um, is it Luke Kane? Yeah, Luke Kane. His name is Robin. He's he did a couple of martial. He's he's a really good martial artist. I like him. Um, them two kind of really sort of fight. Johnny Cage. I kind of that was my boy too. They Come on, him. dude. He killed him one. Ah! He, he, he hit him. He hit him in a mommy daddy buttons. Yep. I mean, come on, come on. <laughs> he hit him in the twigs and berries, the fish and tackle, the so, boat and lure, the hook and ladder. Do you know when it's coming out, bro? <laughs> Yeah, the the release date in the U.S. is for uh, April the sixteenth. And if I'm not um, mistaken, it's coming to the theaters and it's coming on HBO Max streaming. Yeah. So basically, if anything comes to the theaters, it's probably going to be on HBO Max. I think that's a safe and assumption I'm, to make I'm, now. And I'm not getting HBO Max. I'm not doing it. It's too many. I, it's too, look, I already got Netflix. I don't need like. And my wife, I think yeah. she she got the Disney thing. I don't need no more, man. I'm done. You got too many subscriptions. Gotcha. Oh, dude, I'm done. I'll rather <laughs> All right, see man. It in the morning. I so it looks like we're, we're gonna see it in the movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that that'll be something I would definitely go see in the theaters, provided yeah. that it's safe, safe enough. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. look, man, this has been um, GCE News. I know mm-hmm. it's a different format, but yeah, because he has a little furry family companion coming to his life, he had to take care <laughs> of it. You know what I'm saying? You no. Know, yeah, 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 yeah. That's a, that's gonna be our mascot. We just haven't given it a mascot name yet. <laughs> you know. <laughs> You might see in the videos with us. But um, yeah, thank you for tuning might. in. Do us a favor. Please subscribe, share, and like, please, so as yep. we, we can grow this gaming community to something yes. awesome. Definitely. So this, we're going we're gonna bigger and better is what we're looking at. There you go. So this is your boy, Blur. It's your boy, Blitz. And we're out of here. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you, everybody. Stay safe. GCE News.